I'm feeling great. Uh, I finally quit smoking, you know? So I'm feeling pretty good about that. I, uh, I smoked ever since I was a kid, so it was kind of tough for me, you know? I remember once I was eight years old, a little kid, behind my garage, sneaking a cigarette back there, and my dad caught me. He hauled me in, I thought I was in for the strapping of my life, you know? What he did is he pulled out a big cigar. Must have been half the size of my arm, this giant cigar. Stuck it in my mouth, lit it up, made me smoke it. All the way through, right to the end. That's when I started smoking cigars real heavy. <laughs> but I gotta get in shape, you know. I'm not, I watch a lot of sports, you know. I love watching sports on the TV, you know. The only sports I don't like is when I try to combine two sports. You ever see those, you know? And the sports don't even go together, you know? Like the guy will run a hundred yard dash and then fish. <laughs> My favorite show is the, the game shows. You know, I like the game shows a lot. You know? So there's one game show the other week, the dating game. You ever see that? Man. That's a cheap show there. The prize on that show, another contestant. <laughs> Last week they had a guy, I was like a crazy guy, loony bin, psycho, wing nut kind of guy, you know? And then they made the girls ask those questions, you know, laced with sexual innuendo. You know, the girl go, bachelor number two, if I were a popsicle, what would you do to me? The guy goes, well, if you're a popsicle, huh? Well, first of all, I guess I'd uh, take your wrapper off. <laughs> if you know what I mean. And then I'd grab a hold of your sticks. <laughs> if you know what I mean. And then I'd press you against the counter until you're broken too. <laughs> Put half you in the freezer till later. <laughs> if you know what I mean. That was nuts. Oh, man, it was a violent world, you know? I, tried, I went to buy a dog. This guy tried to sell me this, the most killing dog in the world, a big pit bull, $600 pit bull, you know? And I don't want to buy that, you know? 600 bucks, holy cow. You know, guy says, this dog will protect your valuables. You know, I don't even have any of that valuable, you know? I mean, I buy the pit bull, that would be the most valuable thing I own right there. <laughs> okay, you guys have been great. Thanks a lot, enjoy.